I decided to study culinary arts just after the Great British Bake Off and I chose the Cordon Bleu because it's a traditional classic institution that's been around for 120 years and so I thought they're going to know a thing or two about food and it was the place for me. You come into a really warm kitchen classroom, sit there with people who are as enthusiastic as you about food, the passion is completely shared and it's just that great feeling, it's a lovely cosy feeling. Le Cordon Bleu has shaped my career in the sense that it's given me the foundations and the techniques that anyone who wants to be a food writer or a, a TV chef or even just a restaurateur needs. You can't work in food in a professional way. You can't deliver recipes to people. You can't really know what you're talking about unless you understand why processes happen. But I couldn't have that knowledge to write those recipes and deliver that information to them without the information that I learned here at Cordon Bleu. Since leaving the Cordon Bleu, I've, well, I'm about to open my own cookery school, not quite as big as this one, just a domestic cookery school for about 10 or 12 students. I've also got a new TV show on ITV, and I've just writing my third book as we speak. So it's, so much has happened since the Cordon Bleu, and every time I do something in food, I always reflect on, on my time here because it gave me the grounding and the foundations that I needed to be a food personality. For people who are keen to follow in my footsteps and do what I did, I would definitely say consider it well, because it is a big step. You know, if you're passionate enough to do it, then you should do it, you have to do it. It's difficult, it's disciplined, but it's a hell of a lot of fun. So enjoy it.